Hey guys, it's Jen. Um, I wanted to just show you something real quick this morning. This is awful lighting. I'm in my son's bathroom because our bathroom's getting worked on, so I have horrible lighting. Um, but I tried a new makeup um, technique yesterday, and I'm so excited. I really just wanted to share it with everybody. So I just wanted to show you the quickest way I've ever gotten ready. Um, and hopefully it works for you too. So I always start with primer. Let me show you just how small amount of primer I use. Just this tiny, it looks bigger in there. Um, I'm gonna use that. I'm very excited because this month, um, Unique has released an eye primer for the month as our kudos. So I'm super excited about that and can't wait to try it, but I love our primer anyway. Um, so I put the primer on. I usually do that and let it soak in for a minute. Um, I'm really just gonna use five products um, plus the primer. I'm going to um, now use our Mineral Touch um, liquid foundation. I use it on Organza, and I'm going to use this um, brush, the, the powder puff, puff brush. I've seen some videos of people doing it and I thought, um, yeah, how are you going to do a liquid foundation, which does turn to powder, um, with a brush. I thought you're going to ruin your brush. You're going to look ridiculous, um, you know, trying that. And I wanted to show you, and I forgot. Okay, I'm putting the smallest amount on. I actually put on a lot more than I normally do. I uh, hope that doesn't mess up. Um, but you probably can't see it so well, but I've got a lot of little blemishes, um, a lot of redness. So I just take this brush and let it work its magic. This is really like Photoshop in a bottle. That's it. I couldn't believe how easy it was. Um, I, I, I'm like, I'm shocked. I'm in shock. This is amazing. Um, so I just did that. No other magic, but it looks magic. <laughs> um, so that's product one took two seconds, it took me longer to talk about it. Then I'm going to um, use my Touch Skin Perfecting Concealer, uh, the tiniest amount, because this stuff really goes a long way. It is a little thicker. And I'm just gonna do that under my eyes. I don't need to put it on anywhere else because it was already covered by everything. Um, so that's product two. Now I'm going to put some beachfront bronzer. Just to kind of give me a little bit of a glow. Product three. Now product four is my brows. <laughs> and it would help if I looked to the right side. I'm going to do the brow comb. And seriously, for moms, especially stay at home um, or work from home, you know, you really don't have any time to yourselves. I love that this took me like not even five minutes. Seriously, it took me longer to talk to you guys. So I'm just doing my brows, just filling in. Any of the weird little holes I have. 
and then the rub gel over it. Um, so I could just leave it at that. I look good. I feel comfortable. I feel like, you know, I don't have, um, I don't have a lot of makeup on. I don't, I, I, but I, I look smooth. Everything is smoothed out. The last thing I'm going to do though, just because I, um, I always feel like I'm not done until my eyelashes are done. Uh, I'm going to do the mascara. If you don't know already, it's, um, gel fibers and the steps are just gel fiber gel. It's it's that easy. So I should have brought a mirror in here with me to help demonstrate this. You really don't need a lot. I just tend to keep putting it on, but the gel goes a long way. Just do the gel on this one eye and before um, it dries, I want to put the fibers on so it sticks to the gel. You just want to do the tip. You don't want to get too close to the eye because then the fibers will get in your eye. And you can already see the huge difference in this eye versus this eye. You want to seal this. You want to seal the fibers on so that they don't get all over your cheek. Always make sure you do that. You can do several layers. I just do one. But look at that difference. It's amazing. And that really took me, the video is seven minutes. It's gonna be eight minutes probably at the end. Um, but the first minute I talked and um, it really, this really is a five minute face with five products um, and then your primer and, br and uh, brush. But I cannot emphasize enough using a primer get your makeup to stay on just you know it, it closes your pores it seals your pores and it helps that makeup so it doesn't just fall into your pores and look like um, you know ages you more and just doesn't have a nice soft finish so I really wanted to share today that technique that I learned yesterday I was I, I was just so shocked by it I you know I've watched how many videos of people doing it and I'm like all right let me just try and um that it worked I, I love it <laughs> I'm so excited all right I lied it's gonna be a nine minute video and that's just because I'm taking my time and I don't have kids pulling at me right now okay Thanks everyone for watching and um, see you again.